right, we're gonna do the handstand. So I wanna show you how I do this, guys. So I talk about it in my vlogs quite a bit. Uh, I'll show you how to get it, to practice it, and how to start, how to get up. This is the best way to do it in the most eff effective way. So I'll put the watch there so I can check my, the time. So hands, one length back from the wall, shoulder width, left leg forward, starting leg, push-up leg, and the right leg is the balance leg, I call it. And ready, let's go. Alrighty. So, that's 45 seconds, so I need to get 16, 45, 17, 45 to make the minute. Imagine this is my third one today. I'm not in practice. Lately I've been slapping a bit with the handstand. So you can see how I do it, and I do do it. And it's really, really great to do this. It's fantastic for the back, arms, shoulders, core, and your mental strength, and I balance a bit towards the end, and down. Okay, that was 45 seconds, that one. Now, <coughs> I can do a minute, minute and a half, but uh, the most important thing is that you get, learn to get up, that way against the wall, rather than the people that crawl up with the, you know, up the wall this way. And that way it's much easier, but it's not really that efficient. You've got to learn to swing up. You've got to have the guts to swing up. There's also a, it's a mental hurdle that you need to overcome. People fear it for some reason, because they're kind of like feeling like they're going upside down and may fall down on their head or something like that, but you don't really. You just got to lock your arms and there's nothing much can go wrong. Better to do it with someone in the beginning to help you. Help you bring the legs up and you're good. And I wish that dog would stop barking over there. Anyway, have a great day. It's Thursday here in Bali and we're going into a long, beautiful Christmas weekend. Merry Christmas, everyone, and a Happy New Year from Rob here. RobSouthCrunch.com. Do it.